We're joined here right now by BJ Kramer, also known as King of the X Jews. BJ, how are you? I'm doing great. How you doing, Chris? <laughs> I'm doing well, and obviously we're live here at TAM 2012. And BJ, how many uh, TAMs have you been to? This is my fourth, but they all tend to kind of blur together in just a haze of wonderfulness. <laughs> what now? What brings you back each time? What's your favorite part about it? Uh, the bacon. <laughs> no, uh, well, yes, that, that's the honest answer. Yeah, the people. Um, I made friends here that I only see once a year, uh, and many that I get to see more often as well. But uh, there's never a collection like this at any other time, any other place of such awesome awesomeness in awesome numbers. Now, speaking of this being your fourth time, what was the first time like when you came out here? Um, frightening. <laughs> it was intimidating. I was a volunteer the first year, mm -hmm. and I ended up spending a lot of time behind the scenes, so I was dealing with Randy and various other heroes I had recently heard of, um, but everybody was just easy access and friendly and kind of just gracious, and, you know, I got to tell my story 50, 60 times an hour, and, um, you know, I bumped into Adam Savage, who, you know, just gave me all the time I wanted, which is kind of amazing, and um, it hasn't changed much in the years I've been here. I keep coming back and keep having... Better time than the year before? I'm going to explode from joy one of these years. <laughs> I think that's a distinct danger. You were talking about bacon being one of the draws, and uh, you are the guy behind the bacon at the Bacon and Donuts party, which is going on tonight. Yeah. And uh, how did that, how did you get roped into that? <laughs> um, it was actually my idea, although it wasn't serious at first. Lesson to be learned, folks. Don't ever speak your ideas out loud, because someone will expect you to follow through on them. <laughs> Penn had posted on Facebook that he was going to compensate for the intelligence of Tam by bringing the stupid, having a rock and roll party and serving Krispy Kreme donuts. He, he famously isn't much of a drinker, so he, um, he wanted to have something he'd be giving out. And donuts are really it. That's the best thing, close to the best thing in the world. Of course, the best thing is bacon. So I jokingly said to him, that sounds great, I'll bring bacon. And he texted me, he said like, really, for, for everybody? You know, it was like elementary school, like you got enough for the whole class? So I thought about it, I was like, yeah, 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 I'm bringing it for everybody. Contacted the uh, hotel catering staff, and we got it done. Of course, it wasn't enough. It ran out like halfway through the show. So this year, I've put my foot down. We will have enough bacon for everyone. I'm looking forward to it. Last year, they did run out of bacon, but it was really funny because you go into this party, and instead of people drinking, although there was some of that going on, mm -hmm. people were walking around with plates of Krispy Kreme donuts piled with bacon on top and just eating them together. And this mm -hmm. is part of the part of the fun listening to Penn's band just to have a blast on stage are we going to expect the same type of thing tonight um the band is a little different this year and they're doing mostly original music mm -hmm. um for those who are watching this you can go back in time and experience it and <laughs> that's not going to help very much but they actually put the lyrics up on on a website for the band so they're expecting everybody to be a little uh involved read up on it sing along they did a uh, practice run uh two nights ago mm -hmm. uh and the songs are great and it's going to be a phenomenal time well i'm looking forward to it and provided it's a phenomenal time this year i'm hoping it happens again next year and i'm hoping if you're not here that you're going to be joining us at the party and the rest of tam next year crick don't rise as penn says not you, that I have any idea what that means <laughs> you'll have to buy more bacon though <laughs> you know what i hope i hope tam grows to the point where bacon bankrupts me that's that's my hope very nice bj kids thank don't you very listen much. to that <laughs> you'll have an inheritance when the bacon kills me thanks for joining us <laughs> my pleasure let's sir. let's have fun tonight indeed